is still hoping to get a sense of elephant numbers across this vast park. Now, you'd think spotting elephants on a largely barren landscape would hardly be difficult, but it's astonishing how the largest animal walking the earth has a knack of vanishing. Fortunately, Mark has arranged for us to join an elephant survey being conducted by Andy Plumtree and Polycarp Mwima of the Wildlife Conservation Society. So all we can do is wait for the helicopter to find a rhino to begin a new population of the species in the north. The job of finding a likely candidate somewhere in the 30,000 acre park belongs to Dr. Kakuila, Kenya Wildlife Service's chief vet and rhino data. We regain our composure with a nagging feeling that a further fast journey is decidedly on the cards and await a text from Dr. Gakuya. comes to no harm, it's important that it's left unconscious for as little time as possible. Yeah. 
This is um, extraordinary, this quivering beast, this enormous, powerful animal, just felled like that. All kinds of things going on all at once. Everyone knows what they're doing. I'm desperate not to get in the way. It's a bit frightening, really, but... <laughs>